So there's a white van coming through now. Let's see if it makes it through. It should do, everything else has, it depends. I always carry my wellies in my car and it's a good job I have today. That is literally the car park of Aylston uh, playing fields, I think it's called, where they play football. Um, I'm going to go and see how much I can see. Just here watching people attempt to drive through these floods on Broad's Delay East. It's very deep and a little Ford Fusion has just got through. This 4 before is alright, getting through. Crazy! <laughs> it's up around my wellies quite high though. There's an abandoned car just down there. But it's really deep in the middle. This van's just attempting it now. It's when you get near the blue car that it starts to get really deep in the middle. A big transit van came through and did okay. And the Ford Fusion did all right because it went up on the pavement. But this could be tough. He's very deep. And he's now up on the pavement. He's edging through very slowly. It is really bad just there. God, that is so deep. It looks like he's made it. I certainly wouldn't be tackling it. Fair play. He's about there. There's a very small Hyundai considering attempting it. But I can't even begin to tell you how deep it is. Stuff is floating down here on Bronze the Lane East. Up to my ankles, and I'm on the pavement here. So God knows what it's like right in the middle. So I'm now stood on the pavement now. So I dread to think what it's like on the road because this is just bonkers. There's a white van attempting it up that end. And it's like there's a few vehicles turning round now just here. I think they've saw sense. But this white van's giving it a go. I'm going to get quite wet unless I move. So there's a white van coming through now. Let's see if it makes it through. It should do, everything else has. It depends on where he goes. That, that is really deep just there. <laughs> oh, he'd be gone. I just don't know if it's worth the risk doing it just to save yourself a few minutes. Here we go. Oh, I think he's going to be OK. It's quite high there, his vehicle. It's still deep though, just here. I've never seen anything like that in my life. People attempting that. Um, crazy. Right, let's have a look at the uh, playing fields where they play the football. I think it's safe to say that a Pep Guardiola fast, high press passing game would not work under these conditions. Take a look at this. This is on the bridge entering the playing fields. And there we go. <laughs> I'm having to wade through slowly. The exercise equipment's all over there. They play cricket on here from April till September, believe it or not. And you could just make out the goals. I can't go much further than this or my jeans are going to get absolutely soaked. There's swans, there's gulls, and there are football pitches there. So there is a little bit of grass remaining. You might be able to get like a three a side going. But apart from that, tennis courts, all the football pitches, everything underwater, that pavilion clubhouse was built on stilts for this exact reason. Madness. On our doorstep in Braunstone Town. 
Well, there we go. Well done to the cars that got through the flooding. You're braver than me. Hope that's uh, been of interest to you for a few minutes. And uh, any other weird and wonderful things that happen around our area, I'll try and capture them. All right, catch up in a bit.